Hey guys, it is Lauren here from Chasing the Tickle. So anyway, today I'm actually going to be showing you a crown kind of beginner's luck wrap. So as you guys can see, I'm actually a bit dressed up today because on Saturday, I'm actually going to see my beloved Crusaders rugby team play. Uh, the Crusaders are actually based from Christchurch and I love them. They're like... Uh, they are actually the most successful uh, super rugby team in history. They've actually run, won themselves nine titles. They are actually the current super rugby uh, title holders at the moment. So I'm pretty excited because I'm actually going to see them this weekend. And I decided that I just actually get dressed up today. You guys can't actually see because I've got my bed in the way. But I've actually got, um, it's actually Cheat's version. I've actually got my maxi dress on, but I'm just hiding it under a singlet. Um, and then it goes down to uh, past my down to my ankles and then I've got my uh, sleeve on from my, my long sleeve shirt on for modesty and then just got a red top on on top and the great thing is it, it's my cut my team colors so red and black are actually our team colors so I'm actually pretty excited so anyway with it being the team colors and everything like that I decided to do this wrap for this weekend and I've been doing this wrap for a wee while now, but I haven't actually had a chance to actually film it to show you guys how I've done it. So first, first and foremost, I'm wearing my Uber poof today. So this is going to be my first Uber poof wrap. And yeah, it's huge. Like, don't get me wrong, it's huge. But the thing is, I am one of those people who are really kind of, I don't know what the word I would say. I think the word I'd be looking for is that I am very kind of um, experimental and I say to a lot of people don't be afraid to experiment because this is the um, only way that you're going to learn how that what works and what doesn't work and everything like that so and this is the only way I've ever learned how to experiment so yeah anyway let's get on with this uh, this video so as you guys can all see I've got my uber poof shaper on this is the blonde one um, the great thing is also um, with this one, there's no Velcro or anything like that. So if you guys have got a larger head or you're worried about your um, scarf snagging, um, look for um, the Cloud9. What is it? The Cloud9, the Wendy and the Uber are the only shapers out of the Rapunzel line at the moment that are actually... Um, don't have velcro don't have the velcro to attach at the bottom all the others do except for the classic one where it's a tie one and you still need to get a velvet hemp band for it but this one you don't need it and that's what I like about it because I have a paranoia that my scarves will snag I have a lot of holes in some of my scarves that's for using pins but I don't have snags which is great I'm using today sparklelicious scarf so uh, you can get these off Rapunzel um, actually this one I didn't get from Rapunzel. I'm going to just let you guys in on a bit of a secret. This one I did not get from Rapunzel. I got it from AliExpress. It was just a lucky score that I ended up finding. I went, oh, pretty shiny scarf. Get it? And it's exactly the same. So uh, I'm going to be in on a secret. This one is from, definitely from Rapunzel. It's a black one. This one isn't. But um, it is red. So it just goes with the... Um, style it just goes with the colors so anyway let's get on with this uh, wrapping so anyway what you're going to need initially is you're going to start off with the black as the base layer but the thing is is that you are going to have uneven tails so I'm going to say possibly from about here I'm just going to wouldn't say it's off center but it's close enough
and there we go you that's how much length you're probably going to need you might need slightly longer just depending on your volume and just how you want to do it effectively what's going to happen is you will be tying from about here and you'll be just basically doing a beginner's luck wrap so that's effectively what we're going to be doing so but just bear with us at the moment so that's the base layer done i've just done it in black and it's just a back tie so that's all it is there's no specifics to it it's just there's no specifics to it it's just um just an um basic tie when we're going to start layering off on the second one so with the second one we're going to just fold it back just slightly um mainly because um we just want to still keep that um little bit of black exposed for you so then you can see so then you can just see just um you know, sort of got a bit of a fancy look going on here. Got a bit of a abstract thing going. So that's all we really want to do. So they're now both tied. Now, as you guys have seen from the other great thing is about the Uber poof is that it's quite forgiving. So as of before, it was all pff, pff. Now it's kind of all coming to more of a bun shape. So it's now sort of come into more of a bun shape now so beforehand it was all kind of a little bit squished out but that's the great thing about these ones is they're quite forgiving in that sense just tuck in wherever you think needs to be done but yeah all right the next step is we're going to now cross these over and we're going to sort of make a twist crown going down so we're just going to keep twisting until you get to the end of the to the end of the thing there we go all right now once we're finished we're just going to pop it over our head just over here and then we're going to get our other two scarves pull it through the hole and that's it that's all that's it there's nothing else to it it's pretty simple. Personally, I would have gone for a little bit more length on the short side here, just as a little bit more, not too much. But that's it. If you guys want to pop a pin in, you can, or maybe um, you want to pop a headband here that, you know, to make it a little bit more fancy, that's really it. But I love the shine of these sparklicious scarves because they really, you don't really need to have any more glamour going because I just like how it's just basic and simple, but it gives you that really good thing the other thing is you can pull this down a little bit lower so what we might just do now yeah there we go and yeah that's it so that's how simple and easy it is i'll just turn around for you guys hang on i'm just going to adjust this slightly There you go, that's a little bit better. So yeah, I'll turn around for you guys and just show you quickly. And yeah, that's pretty much it. It's very simple. It's actually probably as basic as you can get it. All we're doing is just putting two scarves on and then wrapping the um, tails around and then tying it through the loop here. And that's pretty much it. And you know, the thing is, is that you could wear it actually for a sort of a going out setting or something that's a little bit more fancier you could also dress it up a little bit more and you'd still actually have quite a decent wrap scarf and that's really good the other last bit is is that I'm just going to actually put this on as you guys know here I'm going to see my boys 
Yep, so put this on and I'm ready for the game. So, oh, no, we're not anymore. And yeah, now I'm actually ready for the game. So there we go, guys. Yeah, it's a um, just a easy kind of beginner's luck crown um, for those people. And it, I've just used an Uber poof today. So yeah. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I will try to actually get out a vlog at least once a week uh, for a tutorial. I do apologize that I haven't been able to put out vlogs recently. I've been very busy and also had a lot of personal issues to deal with. So I'll put them out as soon as I can. This is not obviously the easiest thing in the world, but I will try my best. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you like this vlog, make sure to subscribe to my channel. And also make sure to uh, check out Chasing the Tickle on Facebook and Instagram as well. All right, guys, bye.